back everyone. Let's go straight to the t &E segment. And today we have here students from Makers Place School. Yeah. Okay, so how are you guys doing today? Okay, so Anelam, we are fine, thank you. And so, hi, my name is Ella. And hi, I'm Brenda. So, what are we going to be doing today? So today, we are going to show and explain how to build an automatic water dispenser. Okay, so let's start then. So before we start, in the olden days, we all knew that uh, people used to fetch water from streams and rivers. But as yes. we kept involving, we got taps and we had buckets to fetch the water from the tap into the bucket. Mm -hmm. But now, because of modern technology's advancements, we now have water dispensers, which, put, which when we push a button, we put the cup there and then the water Comes. The normal dispensers work by pushing the button depending on the type of water you want, whether hot or cold. You decide on the buttons to push. Due to COVID-19, most people do not like touching many surfaces, so this automatic water dispenser would help a lot. Yes. Okay. So what do you need to do first? Okay, so, the com so to build an automatic water dispenser, the components we will need are... A container. A water pump, a water pipe or tube, a breadboard, a USB cable, a Arduino board, an ultrasonic sensor, okay. jumper wires, okay. um, a relay and a battery holder, and batteries. Okay. <laughs> so so now we are coming to show you how to build the circuit for the um, automatic water dispenser. Okay. So let's start. So let's start. So now Brando is connecting the red wire to the 5 volt vo hole on the Arduino board onto the positive rail on the on the breadboard and then she connects the black wire on to ground on the arduino board and to the negative rail on the breadboard now the ultrasonic sensor has four pins and in our previous session we explained how and how how and what it does now she's going to connect the ultrasonic sensor to the Arduino board and to the bread, to the Arduino board. And in our previous session, we explained how and what the ultrasonic sensor does. But we used it for a robot to help it avoid obstacles. But now we are using it for the um, for the water dispenser to sense a cup when it's there. So this is a different application for the ultrasonic sensor. She is going to connect the relay to the breadboard and the Arduino. So she's taking COM on the relay and connecting it to 10, to hold 10 on the Arduino board. So which industry can this be used in or can it be helpful at home? Okay, so yes, it can be helpful at home because of the COVID-19. Nobody really wants to touch surfaces because it's not really allowed. So this will be very beneficial for everybody so that nothing bad can happen to the family. Okay. So now she's connecting the positive wire on the battery to the positive rail on the breadboard and the negative wire on the battery to the negative rail on the breadboard. Now, Ella is going to upload the code to the Arduino board. So now we have to use a USB cable to connect the, um, the Arduino board to the laptop. Okay. 
So what is the objective of this project? Okay, so it's to dispense water automatically without nobody pushing any button or leaning the cap against a latch or okay. a switch. So now I'm just going to upload the code. So it's done. So now we are going to put everything that we have assembled right now into the cardboard design. Okay, so Brando, please, can you help me? Okay, like a cardboard water dispenser. Okay, that. Okay, so now we are done assembling the our circuit into the cardboard design. Okay. So now Brendo is going to show us how it works. So now Anelam, please, can you test it out for us? Okay, sure, yes. So as you guys observe that Anelam, as he placed the cup in front of the ultrasonic sensor, it detects the cup and then the water pump pumps the water out of the tube and into the cup. Okay, that, that's actually very interesting. Um, I'm sure that I would give it a try if I were. I might go to the maker's place soon just to see. I think the t &E segment shows so many cool stuff and I want to give it a try. Yeah, that would be a very nice thing if we could have you. <laughs> yeah. So, thank you very much for coming today. You're welcome. This is us.